All right, welcome to Bellatro. This is the demo version. This game is not out yet, but it is basically a card deck building game where you're trying to play poker hands. Uh, love the music in this game. I might turn it down just a tad though, as much as I love it, but we're going to be jumping right in. Um, so we have, I know a lot about this game already because I've, I've watched a few people uh, play. I'm going to skip this guy. Okay, so the whole idea is that we have different blinds which are basically stages. And we basically need to make this number of chips to be able to survive the round. Right now, it doesn't look like we can skip any of the blinds, but later on we can skip them to give bonuses that are here. We have four hands to play and we can discard cards four times. And then you can select up to any number of cards to discard. We have a deck of 52 cards, which is the normal deck uh, of cards. But there are different decks that you can play with that give you different bonuses or uh, handicaps. This is our money, which can be used in the shop later on. And we're trying to get through five antis and the final boss is like 52,000 credits or, or uh, chips we need to earn basically. These are our points. This is the number of chips we gain. And this is our multiplier, which will change based on what kind of joker cards we get, which are in these five slots. And then we have two consumables, which are like uh, tarot cards and planet cards, which can upgrade your bonuses for certain hands and stuff. But let's just get into it. Um, we'll see how it goes. We're on round one. And so you can see our hand here. I'm going to skip this guy once again. I'll explain it. So right now we have a pair right here. We're trying to get 300 chips, um, but a pair is not super great. We have two, three, four, five. So I'm going to probably discard uh, one of the fours and these cards to try and get a straight. It is a low, it is a low straight though, so it won't be amazing. But basically how it works is our straight level one is 30 chips times four, which is already 120 points. But it also gains six chips for the five, uh, six, five chips for the five and so on. So a higher level straight would be more valuable. I'm also going to change the game speed because the, the default game speed is painfully slow. Let's just say that. So settings, game speed. Um, I'll go for two just so it's a little more easy to see. There we go. All right, so we got a pair of jacks. We actually got a two pair. That's probably good enough to play. And you can play like an extra card. Let's say I want to discard this four. Then I can discard it with the two pair but it won't be included in the, the points and you can see already that gained us 112 for having a higher pair and there we go and depending on the number of hands and and stuff you have remaining you get money and if you don't spend all your money if you have it five dollars okay enough of you um you uh basically get more interest as you go so we have a permanently gained one hand per round i definitely want to grab this at some point it's very useful to have extra hands to play um so what i'm gonna do for now i'm gonna buy this joker and probably chill with that so I can get like the uh, interest going. All right, bigger blind. Now we have skips, here we go. So you can start the next round with an extra four, three discards, but I wanna grab that voucher. So I'm gonna play this hand out. I have three pairs on the board. I gotta start with, I gotta start with two pair just to see what it looks like. And what I'll do is I'll just get rid of an eight with that. Yeah, so six times uh, the points is a lot better. We're already at halfway, and we have a full house. Uh, aces are uh, 10 ch chips each, so we're going to get an extra, like, 34 chips here. And it's on fire, which means we're probably winning. As you get more bonuses, you get, like, it shows that it's more more impactful. And there's the interest. We get one interest per $5, and you can get up to $5 max out of the interest. Aces give... Extra plus four malt and 20 chips pl when played. That's pretty good. But I do want to buy this. So I think I'm going to buy this. Because I don't think you can get it after the boss. I'm not really sure. So unfortunately we can't buy this. It would have been great though. But an extra hand is us usually very helpful. So our heart cards are debuffed. Which means we basically don't... Uh, we don't get any impact on chips. Because of the debuff. So... You can still play them in a hand, but I'm probably going to do one of my discards here. And I'll leave the rest. Go for face cards. Uh, not great. <laughs> I don't want to keep using all of my discards super early, but... Okay, we got two pair, but it's not going to be amazing. We will do that to start. Alright, so we're already almost halfway there. We got a pair of tens. Uh, we got two pair again. Let me do that because it definitely levels up the uh, the chip bonus. 
Yeah, we're, we basically just need like a couple more points, so not too bad. And there's three three of a kind. That should just do it. Yep. Perfect. And you know, I'm actually going to make the game speed go four times, because this is actually still pretty slow. Let's see what money we get here, though. Two extra hands remaining. We get $7. We have 10 Oh, see, yeah, so this is another shop with another voucher. Uh, let's do game speed four real quick. There we go. Permanently gain one discard. Not as great. Not discovered. Wait, what the heck? I'm going to try this. I'm not sure what it does. Oh, so it's going to give a random amount of malt. That's better than nothing. Let me try a celestial pack. So we have Mercury, which is upgrade a pair. We can upgrade our straight or full house. Full house is two malt. Straights are hard to get, but it is very valuable if you get it. Pairs are kind of throwaway. I'm not really building for pairs. So we'll go for a full house. It's probably the easiest to get. Unfortunately, we do not get uh, our interest, but... Let's hold off of that for now. We don't really have anything here. I don't really want to get rid of my jo uh, jack in case I get another jack, which I just did. We also got ace, king, queen. I just got a straight, so... I mean... I think I'll play that. It's 30 times 4, where 3 of a kind is what? 30 times 3. This should probably like get me most of the way here. Let me try this. Uh, yeah, it got, we got the win. <laughs> and the more hands I have remaining is better because I get more money. It has just two cards. Okay, I'll go for the odd joker. These aren't great. These aren't great jokers, but they will definitely do okay. It doesn't, and the order of these jokers does matter if the multipliers are like, mul like if this one's a, t a times multiplier, you'd want to put it at the end after these multipliers are added and the chips don't matter because they're chips, but. A mega celestial pack. I'm probably not gonna do that. I'm probably just gonna play it out so I get some get some money, build up an economy. Now we don't have any. We have three hearts. Two, three, four. We need a five, maybe. So maybe I pay our, pay uh, these two cards for a pair. Let's see what we kind of get here. A right, huge multiplier. All right, we actually got three, four, five, six, seven. So I'm gonna do that. And that'll maybe get us the whole way there. Because the odd cards give us so many chips. So straights are great because they give you at least two uh, bonus chips. Maybe three if you have an odd, odd, even, odd, even, odd. But it's kind of hard to determine. So this is an interesting one. It's like an ice cream joker where it gives you 100 chips at the beginning per round. But then minus five chips per card. It's like a nice little buffer, but I'd rather like start to build up interest. Level up high card. High card's kind of terrible because it means we're like kind of throwing away around. Let's let's we must play five cards now. So I guess what I'll do is okay. Let me actually just try to discard for a second. I don't like getting rid of high cards here. We also have three, four clubs actually. So let me do that. I don't really want to play a high card here. And there we go. Flush is pretty good. And we also get... Yeah. Like, that's just crazy. <laughs> These jokers are actually doing pretty well for us super early on here. $11. The interest is helping. Let me grab a Celestial pack. Pair. Full house again. Full house is going to be huge for us. It's times 8 multiplier base. I don't really want to reroll. I'm probably just going to go. We're doing okay so far. Maybe I'll get a Mega Pat. Uh, no. It's $8. I don't really want to do that. We're still handling the rounds pretty pretty easily. Okay, we can sort by suit. We have three spades. We're also just missing uh, a, a 10 or like... Or... Yeah, it's just a 10, right? So... Let me do one discard here. 
Well, that's very troll. Now we're missing a four. <laughs> uh, we do have four hearts. So maybe I'll transition. No way. Oh, this is so bad. Um, because now we don't have now we have the ten. We don't have the the uh the flush. I gotta commit to the flush. Are you kidding me? I'll take it. That's not great. Low cards are not good. Okay, we got king, queen, jack, ten, nine. So we'll play that. This guy is not giving us great multipliers. Four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, this guy's a little random. He could give you like really good multipliers or really bad multipliers. We gotta be really careful with that. Uh, when blind is selected, destroy Joker to the right and permanently add its cell value to this multiplier. That's decent if we were to like start building on like bad Jokers. I think I'm just gonna buy a Celestial for now. Straight flush is never gonna happen. I think full house we upgrade again. Our full house is very strong. Uh, I will just go next round here. We're okay so far. Ooh, after defeating the boss blind, which starts with zero discards, by the way. I'm gonna stay because I wanna like find a shop that like can give me something good. We have three we have four spades. Let me discard here. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's just... Let me just run two pair here. It's not great. But we need to start making some, some plays. And we got a decent multiplier, so... That is okay. Ace, two, three, four, five. The ace is worth playing because it is a uh, 10 chip card. So it's not worth going two, three, four, five, six. But it's still a lower chip value. Okay, decent. We have two, three, four. A pair of fours, not great. We have four diamonds. So I think I'll discard these. Play the flush. Ah, oh, good multiplier. There we go. We have four spades. Do we just play the pair? I think we just play the pair. And then this might get us there, depending on the multiplier. It did. Yeah, I was going to say, we don't really want to, like, discard and hopefully not even get anything. Upgrade a pair for $4. I'd rather just get a Celestial pack that, like, gives me a potential better. I'm going to grab this Fool card, too. So this Fool card, I have to use this, too. There we go. Uh, spawns the last tarot or planet card during this run. Okay, I'm going to keep this. I played... Let's see if I can get a full house. Or something decent. Three of a kind or two pair. Maybe I'll play... Um, I'll use this. And what I'll do is I'll upgrade the two pair right away. That's not a bad play. To get like a high multiplier on, on two pair. And I will probably stick with my money again. Alright, starts with zero discards. It's a little bit spooky. Not if you get a flush on the first turn. That is kind of disgusting. Yeah, that's pretty gross. Uh, we got ace, two, three, four. We're missing... We're missing a... Five. So what I'll do is I'll just play these two with the the pair of jacks, which is not great points, but we hopefully will get our two pairs decent. Actually, we could do ace king, two pair, and we have a pair of twos afterwards, or we could try to maybe put the two in here for a two three four five six or ace two three. This is probably huge for points anyway. We might just win off that. 
Yeah, we won off that. <laughs> okay. All right. This game is super awesome. I, I really do enjoy like the thought process. Oh, four of a kind's never going to happen. This is a good way to gain some money. Might as well buy it. It pays for itself in one round. Let's get the Celestial Pack here. Flush is decent to upgrade. It's kind of hard to get, but when it does come up, it will be helpful. One card slot available in the shop. Considering we have a uh, Golden Joker, that might be pretty worth it. I'll, I'll try it. Oh, it, it immediately shuffled it. If scoring hand contains an ace and a straight, spawn a tarot or planet card. Um, no thank you. That's kind of hard to do. Uncommon Joker is okay, but... Okay. We have almost a flush with decent high cards, too. So, I'm going to do one discard, even though it's a pair. But it wouldn't give me that many points. So we need a lot of points here. Oh. No way. We're literally split. We have... <laughs> we have four spades, four clubs. I'm going to invest in the... Uh, the clubs. Because this has... I think this is an odd card? I'm not sure. Let's see. No, it's not an odd card. That's kind of weird. Oh, we have four... S oh, these are low diamonds, though. I don't have two pair, either. Pair only gives me 20, and then plus... It'll be 30 times 2, plus all these chips. So these aren't odd, though. I don't want to get rid of all... Ah, uh, man. I'm going to get rid of all the diamonds, I guess. I'll play the two pair. With a three... We have three hands remaining, not too bad. And we, I think we just got the flush, so there we go. It's time six multiplier already. All right, so we get golden joker four dollars, pretty good. Some interest. I don't really like glass cards. Glass cards can shatter. They have a chance to uh, destroy the card. They give you times two malt though. It is very good. All right, let's play this, buy and use. High card upgrade. Three of a kind upgrade. And we have hold plus two cards in your hand. Not amazing. Let's do a celestial pack again. Uh, I'll do two pair. Two pair is getting very valuable here. Uh, and I will hold off, I think. Maybe I'll do one, one set of tarot cards. Uh, no, I'm okay. I'm okay. Enhanced card in the shop if I skip. I, don't, I need money. We have a pair. And we have four hearts. I think I'm just going to go for the, the flush play here. Let's do that. Decent. We have two pair. That's decent. And it's already really good points, so it'll it'll add a lot of value here. But we got bad, we got bad RNG on the misprint, unfortunately. Oh, I don't like this hand. We have three diamonds. We could play for the diamonds, maybe. We did get another diamond. Oh, this is such a waste. Oh. All right, two pair. It's a, it's a good, good value. We have two hands left. This guy's too scary. Misprint is very scary. Like it, it doesn't. You don't know what your guaranteed points are. Three, four, five, six, seven would be good. We don't have a, a seven. We have four diamonds again, still. 
I'm getting rid of a pair by doing this, though. Oh, man, this is tough. I think I'm just going to clear this and see what we get. Okay, two pair of high cards is good. Good multiplier. There we go. Yeah, this this Joker is a little scary. It can give you uh, nothing. Face cards have a one in two chance to give two dollars when played. That's a good way to get money. It really wants me to play flushes, huh? I will upgrade the flush. I gotta use it. Oops. Use. And I'll use a celestial as well. Let's upgrade. Uh, pair maybe. It's level one. I'll do one reroll. Every card played counts in the scoring. That's really good, actually. I'm gonna grab that for now because it is decent. I don't know if that matters what order it is. I'm just gonna put it over here. One in seven cards get drawn face down. Oh boy. All right, so this is either a spade or a heart when I play by suit. And by rank, it is a 10. So we have a full house. It has to be a 10, right? Yeah, it's a 10. Full house is great. Once again, random points did not do us that great. Uh, double ace eight here. So our two pair is pretty good level. And also things count in scoring. So I think I'm just going to pop that in there. I should have done the king, but it's supposed to be odd, right? Oh, we got bad multiplier again. All right. That could be like any number. Oh, well, it's, it's definitely a spade. And it's between... It's between nine and six, and it, well, it could be a nine or a six as well, but it is a spade. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna discard these. <laughs> oh, are you kidding me? I'll do one more discard. I don't like getting rid of the king though. I'll keep that one just as a backup. There we go. And it was an eight. Uh, this is a weird set of hand here, or this hand here is really weird. Our pair is level two only, and it's only 75 points base. Uh, it won't give us any odd. We can add points to it though. Like it's not horrible to just play, but we could also discard for a potential pair here. Okay. Rank-wise, it's a higher card. I'm going to play this and just see what points we get based on three of a kind. Okay, it was three of a kind. Beautiful. I only have one hand left. We need to make a lot of points. This is rough. Two, three, four, five, six. Straight is only level one, though. This, is, this probably isn't going to do it for us. We just need to discard all this and see what happens. Full house. That's already a thousand points base. This should give give us the uh, the points, hopefully. Just barely, just barely the round of, the right amount of points. We're getting kind of sc into scary land here. Jumbo celestial. Okay, let's do celestial pack here. Straight flush is never happening. Let's do three of a kind. Which is decent multiplier for three of a kind now. Uh, I'm going to do our canna pack too. We kind of need to buy some stuff to hopefully make our... Oh, I think we do wild card here. Can be any suit. Well, we have, we have a flush here. If we make this a wild card. So I think I'm going to do that, and I think that's the hand we get in the next round. I'm not really sure, though. Rerolls the boss blind. All face cards are debuffed. Ooh, I might need to reroll this bo boss blind.
Play only one hand for 14,000 points. I need to skip this one too. For the three ha extra. Oh, we only get one hands though. Wait. Did does that count? I don't think that counts. Oh no, we're in trouble. Oh, we also got a new hand, so that's a lot of hearts. Let's see what we get on this. Not even close to 14,000. We're so screwed. Alright, we don't have anything really with this hand. Let's just remove, even though I'm getting rid of a pair, let's just remove all these low cards. I think we have, we don't have a flush. We're very close though. We have six, seven, oh my gosh. We, we could go either direction here. Let's clear, oh, I don't want to get rid of the high cards though. Oh, these high cards. Oh boy, I have decisions to make here. Crazy enough, I'm going to remove everything but the uh, four clubs. This card is screwing us over, by the way. This one is the worst. And then I'll just add, uh, this guy does plus 20 chips. So I'll do that guy. I might just lose on this one. I can't get anything going here. We need a two, we need a four. Like that's not gonna do it. We need way more points. I'm just gonna get rid of all these low cards. These low cards are just not good. Oh, I, I missed the six. Well, we got a full house. This should just do it. Hopefully. Nope. Oh, we're actually just gonna lose right here. Like, that straight's decent, but it's not gonna get us the multiplier needed. Yeah, it's tough. So that's it. That's, that's where it ends. Um, definitely an interesting game. I, I'm gonna try one more round here. This is the uh, full game. There's so many more things going on in the full game. Oh my gosh, what is going on here? I'm very excited for uh, what this game has in store. So we got a new deck. We now have to start with an extra $10. So we can choose one plus one discard every round, or we can do start with $10. I'm probably gonna do that one. And there are daily runs as well as like more difficulties, which is very, very cool. So decent like warm up round to get an idea for the game. Three of a kind. I mean we can play that for our first hand here. It's not gonna do too much. It'll get us one third of the way. Uh this is kinda kinda good. Might just get us done here. There we go. Easy straight. We get some interest because of the $10 we start with. So we already start with qu quite a lot of money. This four malt is decent. It starts us off like in a good run. We're going to hope for some some better, uh, better jokers this time around. Okay, we have four diamonds. Let's just discard these. Let me try to uh, actually full house here. That got us in one hand there. It's perfect. All right, maybe buy this to start uh, getting some money going. Buy a celestial pack. Every time we can upgrade our hands, it's probably a good idea. Upgrade two pair. And uh, maybe an arcana pack too. Enhances two cards the bonus pack. Uh, uh, stone cards give you 50 chips, but they are not a suit or rank. 
It's basically a high card, unless you can get a bunch of them. I'll probably do... Oh, should I destroy two? Maybe I should do bonuses. I'll just bonus these two hearts. Next round. All heart cards are debuffed. Nice, I just bonus two heart cards. Three of a kind, but I'm only going to get... We have a full house here. Um, This is not going to get any points for us, but nearly there just from one. Honestly, that'll just do it. I'm pretty sure. There we go. Golden Joker's already paying off pretty early here. Gain $4 if Poker Hand is a straight. Poker Hand chases, uh, changes on every payout. Okay, interesting. I'm going to buy this and hold on to it for now. I'm going to go for a Celestial Pack here. Full house, I think. We need to upgrade our full house. Hopefully find some. Next. Must play five cards this isn't that bad. We have four clubs. We do get rid of a pair of aces though, which is I'm a little sad about. We have four, five, wait. We straight up have a straight. I'm so dumb. Four, five, six, seven, eight. I almost missed that. Sometimes you can get really tunnel vision of what you want to do. Oh, we don't have a straight here. Of a pair. Ace, two, three, four, five. We just need a five. I'm going to kind of just get rid of these and see what happens. Maybe get another queen or something. Or, yeah. That'll work. The four malt's okay, as long as we can get, like, a, a malt multiplier. Which is a bit of a handful. Adds the number of times a poker hand has been played to malt. That's pretty good. So that doesn't multiply. It just adds. I'm going to grab a Celestial Pack too. Like, maybe we can exploit, like, a, a low, t like, a two-pair and keep doing two pairs. Gives a free Spectral Pack. I think I'd rather the money and go for the shop. So we're trying to play as many two pairs as we can. Plus two malls. We've played two pairs three times now. We have a straight too. Ace, king, queen, jack. That's it. So this is going to start building up as we go. It's good, good to get it early and work on that. Go for a jumbo celestial here. Four of a kind, straight, high card. Flush is good. So is a straight. They're both level one. I'll just go for a, a flush. Maybe I'll upgrade the three of a kind too. And we'll go next round. Must play five cards here. We're missing a ten. Okay, so we have... Ace, King, Queen, Jack. So I think what I'll do is I'll get rid of one of the Jacks. The 9, even though it's a bonus card. And we discard. And we did not find a 10. But we can do... No, we can't do two. Well, we could do two pair with the twos. I think I'll... Must play five cards. Right, 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 right. I'll do this. It's a decent amount already. And we'll probably get it here. I'm going to do a two pair. And play the fifth card as, I don't know, a, a four, I guess. This will probably just get it to it uh, for us, though. It did, in fact. This supernova is going to be pretty helpful later on if we get a multi-multiplier. 
All cards and packs are 25% uh, off? Yes, please. That'll that'll return its investment pretty quickly. Select two cards, convert. I'm gonna use this right away. I don't know why I didn't use this. I haven't I haven't played it yet, so it doesn't really matter. Um, let me do this. Hold on to that. Straight flush is never gonna happen. Celestial pack. Let's do three of a kind. Uh, I have to use immediately, so let's do it. Ooh. I might try for this. Let's do this. Nope. Okay, cool. I was hoping to add one of a, one, a bonus one of my one of my jokers, but unfortunately did not go. All right, let's go. We've expanded the shop. Gold seal card in the shop. No, thank you. Ace two three. We don't have. Hmm. This is a weird hand. I actually don't know what to do. We're missing a four. We're also only missing one club. So I kind of want to do this. There we go. Let's do a two pair again. Start to upgrade this supernova a little bit. And played five times. We have four hearts. Four, five, six. We're missing a seven. Hoping for a heart. There we go. More flushes. Plus 15 malt when... Interesting. Is this the Fibonacci card? <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 5, 8. Okay, interesting. Let me buy a Jumbo Celestial. Full House is level 2. Straight is not upgraded. I'm not sure if it's like better to like invest. Probably like deep into like one thing. I think zero discards remaining is a good play. Um, probably good to play this too. So lower cards are good for me. I need to start looking at uh, my cards and destroy certain things. So I think I'm going to... Huh. Like I don't want to destroy high cards because high cards are good. I think I'm just going to play... The three of a kind and maybe throw like these in there so I can maybe get some more clubs and I'm hoping to convert convert the left card to the right oh I can drag to rearrange nice okay so I think what I want to do is take like a seven yeah I'm gonna take a seven and I'm gonna convert the left card into the right card we have two aces. We have two pair. I'm going to play that so I can start upgrading two pair again. Also, need to remember that I can get add multiplier uh, based on having no discards. But I don't want to just throw them away for nothing. Base cards gives 20 chips when played. The Celestial Pack. Full house again. Let's open up the tarot cards. You have the total sell value of all current jokers. Currently nine dollars. Okay, let's sell this. Let's spawn a random joker. Please be something good. Retrigger scoring cards in final hand of round. Okay, that's pretty good. It's not amazing, but it will definitely help. I'm trying to figure out if four malt is good, better than 20 chips. I think this could be huge, right? I think that like this is not as good as like 
having the face cards be valuable. But I am kind of like contradicting myself with these. Because this is like low cards and then these are face cards. But we'll stick with that for now. I should, probably should have actually... Start with zero discards. Okay, this is actually huge. I have zero discards. So now it's plus 15 malts. And face cards are huge. Is this a face card? I don't know. I can't discard, so I gotta play something. Oh boy, okay, I just realized I forgot that's what we were doing. Uh, I have three diamonds on the table. Let's go for a pair. I'm just gonna play that and see what happens. That's decent points just for that. Ace. Force. This is not great. These are not good. I have to play something. So, my card's so bad. I guess I play a pair. And do I want to, like, shuffle any more cards? I think I might just play all the low cards. Two pair. Get rid of the two. All right, I think we did it. A little spooky. Just for the fun of it, let's play a high card. And there we go. Five interests. We got max interest now. Ooh. Wait, that's really good. Okay, I think we go. We we invest in the face cards. We get rid of Fibonacci, and we buy this, and we get extra hands. We buy a celestial pack. Full house is really good, but it's so hard to do. But this is currently level four. A three of a kind is huge. We gotta remember to do that. Give me planet cards. Okay, convert the left card into the right card. Okay. Let me take this three. And make more aces. I think I want to do that. Okay. Let's stick with this and let's let's start thinking about destroying cards. Lower cards. Like twos. But we need another card. I'm going to leave that two there and discard... These three? Yeah, I'll do that. Ah! I messed up. Okay, let's just play high card here. This is terrible. This is painful. We have four clubs, but my aces, man. I think I'm trolling by doing this. Okay, maybe not. Okay, we're good. The full house. With a bonus card, too? This should get us there, I think. Nice. A little scary, though. Is we uh, don't have a lot of discards. Alright, I'm just going to play this. Because this upgrades the, uh, the multiplier. Same with the Celestial Pack. Anytime we can get planets, we definitely want to do it. Full house, probably upgrade here. We could actually play this. I keep forgetting to buy and use. When any card is played, permanently give it plus one chip. 
Is that better than anything here? Not really. Doubles money. I think I'm going to grab the double money. And I will go and re-roll the shop. Every card play accounts. Oh, this is a negative. Negative gives me mo one more slot for my jokers. And every card play accounts and scoring is huge. I don't know if it matters where I put this. But I want to make sure this multiplies at the very end. I gotta make sure to use this. Adds one voucher. No, thank you. Play my two pair here. And we will play a face card because it counts in scoring. My pair is at a multiplier two, which isn't great. Two pairs at multiplier four. I can play the king with it. Extra face card. Play the jack with it as well. Extra face card once again. Okay. Decent, but not great. We're gonna need some better jokers here. Celestial pack, as always. Uh, we could upgrade pair here. Get the multiplier up higher, then we can just add cards to it. Okay, I'm gonna buy the uh, tarot cards as well. Hoping for... Spawn two random planet cards, yes. Use. Pair is perfect. Three of a kind is also great. Multiplier is going up and up. This is more like it. This four malt is okay. Like this might be just better. I also gotta remember my uh, zero discards. Might be better to just like throw away my cards. One in seven gets face down. It's not great. Oh my god. These are all hearts. Let me let me let me do this and discard these. Oh, they're not all hearts. Okay, shoot. These are both aces. So maybe we maybe we just play the highest ranked cards, see what happens. Two pair. I'll take that. Ugh. <laughs> uh, let's discard all not... F oh, we can only discard five cards. Oh, we actually can see our whole hand. Okay, let's do the, uh, the highest two pair and put a king in there. Actually, a jack. Oh, yeah. Three of a kind. I can also do full house. Uh, run info. We've played three of a kind two times. Two pair 14 times. A full house three times. So both, both have not been played that often. You can see this actually goes down in value like this is three of a kind's a higher value for me maybe I, that's easier to play so we'll just do that upgrade the three of a kind a little bit we play we see planets we we play planets full house or a pair level three We've played two pair the most. So maybe, oh, it's just like so unlikely, unlikely we play a good. I'm going to try and reroll. We got a planet. Nice. Buy and use. Multiply is almost 2.0. Spawn two plants, please. Random tarot cards. 
gonna go for the two random tarot. Please, give me it. Oh, foil. That's huge. It gives plus 30 chips. We can convert things into hearts. I mean, it's not that amazing. Adds a voucher. No, thank you. I don't really care about... Like, I guess I'll do this. And make these all hearts. And then I'll discard these. Now we have a good two pair. Or a full house. Or, or a flush. I... I it's weird, like, I, I playing the flush is good, but it's level 2, plus, like, this will upgrade my multiplier for the 2 pair, which is easier to get, so. Maybe I'll just play, like, an 8 to get some points, or, I guess, a a jack to get the, the face cards. Uh, 2 pair again. With a face card for good measure. Huge. Three or fewer cards. Spectral pack. Okay, we take that. These are rare. Destroy one random card in your hand. Add three random face cards. Sure. Yes, that's perfect. Add some more face cards. I like that. Let's grab the Arcana pack too, or Arcana. Doubles money. Ooh. Let's go for the random, please. No, I should have gotten the money. Uh, I, I got greedy. It's free spectral pack. Let's do it. Skipping that. Swan's a rare. Random rare joker sets money to zero. I have to actually make room for that though, which means I have to get rid of something. I haven't been really doing the, the plus 15 malt, which I should probably be playing into more. This is not that great. I'm going to do this and now we use this and hopefully get a rare joker. Copy the ability of the joker to the right. Oh, and this is huge, right? Double multiplier? All face cards are debuffed? Oh no. Wait, we are in trouble, right? Oh <laughs> no! Crazy enough, I think it's still worth playing the debuff on the chips. No? Maybe this is stupid. Let's see how this does. That's not horrible. Let's play the two pair. Plus, let's add a five in there for the extra chips. Oh, man. We play the two pair. Yeah, we're still doing okay, even with that. Okay, I'm glad aces aren't considered face cards. I mean, they aren't face cards, but... Two pair? That should get us there. Sweet. Feeling pretty good about this double multiplier. Uh, We play planets? Full house or three of a kind? Three of a kind's easier to do. It's level six. Let's make it level seven real quick. We need money. Spectral pack. No. <laughs> All right. Final challenge. 50,000. I haven't even been using this one. Let's think about it. This is adds the number of times a poker hand has been played into a malt. So... The only one that's going to be doing good with that is two pair, which is my most common thing. And multipliers are pretty huge. So if I'm aiming for, if I'm aiming for, oh, dude, 
<laughs> or I could sell a negative, but then that actually messes with me, doesn't it? No. If I don't play two pair, this is not as useful. So I think I sell this, but I have to make sure that I get rid of all my discards, which is also a little scary. So maybe I do this. Is every card played in scoring really that useful? This is a tough decision. I can't get rid of these. This is just like the dumbest thing to do if you remove this. I think I remove this guy. And what I do is I remove as much as I can right now. Three, four, five, six, seven. That is just a straight up straight. It's level one though. And no face cards. I think I play it and just see how that does. Okay, that was the stupid thing to do. So we need to discard. We need to discard. That's so stupid. Why did I do that? Uh, okay. Discard. Oh, this is so good. Oh boy. Uh, discard. Uh <laughs> I have two pairs of everything! Ah, uh, okay. Bye-bye, Jack. Okay. I think I actually play... two pairs of kings here. And then, oh, I need one more pair. I don't have any discards. Pair is decent. I think I play these and just get rid of them. Two pairs should do it. I think it's actually better than playing the full house. But also, this this can be added to... Oh, no, I don't have that anymore. <laughs> it should be okay, though. I think we have it. Oh, man. What a game. And that's Bellatro. I hope you guys enjoyed. What an amazing run that was. Definitely better than the first one. Uh, the multipliers are just huge. Like, having the, the card copy... The, the MVP of this round, I believe, was the uh, spawn a random rare joker. So, yeah. Pretty cool game. I love the RNG of it. It definitely feels fair. It feels like you you have control of the game. Uh, but yeah, definitely check it out. Um, it's coming out soon. I don't think the release date is announced yet, but super cool game. Hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, have a great day, and I'll catch you in the next one.